very glad to share this thought with all of you. Today's thought is from Psalm 148, verses 12 and 13. Both young men and maidens, old men and children, let them praise the name of the Lord, for his name alone is exalted. His glory is above the earth and heaven. Here, the Bible is asking us to give praises to God. The Lord is pleasing with his praises. The Lord dwells in his praises. Here, the Bible is asking all the age group of people to give praises to God, including children, including the old people, young men and women, everyone. God is calling us to give praises to Him. Why? Bible says, His name is above all other names. His name is exalted. And also Bible says, His glory is above all the earth and heavens. He is worthy for all our praises. Many times, we are not ready to give praises to God. Something is not allowing us to give praises to God. But give praises to God. It will change your situation. When you give praises, the Lord will turn your captivity into freedom. When you give praises, the Lord will break all the barriers. When you give praises, your sorrow will turn into joy. Give praises to God. He is worthy for all your praises. Today make a decision. I will praise you, Lord. Shall we do a word of prayer? Lord Jesus, help us to give praises to you. Many times, Lord, we are going through sorrow and tears. We are not able to praise you. This, this morning, we believe that your name is name above all other names. You alone worthy for all our praises. Lord, encourage your children to give praises. Let their captivity turn into freedom. Lord, let the sorrow turn into joy. Let your mighty hand come upon your children right now. You bless them, strengthen them, encourage them, Lord. Jesus, fill them with your joy. In Jesus' name we pray. God bless you. Give praises. The Lord will change your situation. Amen.